Hey, what's up? So it's been a long time since we got a recent chapter of Berserk. And it's hard to make theories on something that is so stagnant at times, right? But I was reading some Norse mythology recently and I saw a story about these two people called Ask and Embla. And I thought it was significant to the world of Berserk because they reminded me of Guts in the sense that both characters in this Norse mythology as well as Guts, they were born from, you know, a tree. So the interesting thing about these characters is that they represent the hope and potential in humanity because Ask and Embla went on to control Mega and create all the humans that existed there. Whereas in Guts's case, Guts may actually be the last human to stand against the forces of evil. And I know that sounds really cliche and cheesy, but what I mean by that is that in this world of Berserk, Guts is the only entity that is able to stand against fate and all these forces that are against him. Odin, as we saw in Norse mythology, he is this god who he wanted knowledge and wanted to have full co control and power. And Griffith reminds me a lot of Odin because how he is able to use the world tree to travel, the representation of um, the birds because Odin was uh, akin to like a, I believe a raven or a crow. And in God, I mean in Griffith's case, Griffith is that of the hawk. And there's other similarities that I will get into in another video. But I just want to make this quick video because I thought it was really interesting and I was reading it. And I'm going to start making videos on other series with you guys. I'm done with school. I have no excuses now. So I could start doing a regular schedule. I want to talk about series like Goblin Slayer. If you guys haven't watched that one yet, that's really good. Um, and there's so many other animes and mangas I read and watch all the time. I really want to touch upon those things. But... I am not dead, we're still here, it's just like now that everything is done, I have to focus on YouTube 100%, I'm going to do just that. And this will be the last type of video I shoot like this for a little bit, because I want to make sure and give you guys quality content. Hey, and I just want to also say one last thing, thank you so much for supporting me and Roche's channel. Um, thank you for being there for us, thank you for being patient with us, and you know, it's really interesting to still see comments coming in even though I haven't made a video in so long. So I really appreciate y'all's support and I'm gonna strive to earn it by making quality content that you guys deserve. Anyways, take care. And <laughs> oh, my phone is so confusing. Peace.